65 Gamer Guy here with a review of Sonic the Hedgehog on the Sega Genesis. Sega! When the Genesis first came out, I didn't own one, but a friend of mine did. And I remember seeing this game on, on his Genesis. And I thought it was pretty amazing. I remember the speed of it, how fast it went, the, the nice colors of the game. It was kind of a, kind of blew me away, I guess, in a way. Now, I didn't own it. Genesis back then, so my gameplay is not very good at this game. But I really like the game. It's a fun game, it's fast, it's very colorful. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of different places to go that a lot of them I really don't probably haven't found yet, but say this is one of my favorite favorite games like I said I'm not very good at it but it is it, fun to play every now and then I'll find places I haven't been to that's always fun The music in this game is really good too. I mean, this was the era when video games started to have more, I guess, features you'd say, where they had music. I mean, the older days, like in a Coleco and in television, you'd have kind of some music and I wouldn't say rudimentary sounds, but they were a little bit better than just a boop, 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 boop you know, stuff like that. But the, or this era of games really started to incorporate more music and stuff like that, which really made it nice.
always have a problem with these uh, these areas that you have to make the small jumps to. I don't know. I just kind of things like that have always made me nervous in video games. <laughs> Sixty-five Gamer Guy here. Thanks for watching. 